It's a no-brainer that we all want to be successful. Being successful comes at its own cost, and the cost is nothing but hard work. Is being successful your goal in life? If you answered yes, this is the perfect video for you to watch. In this video, we will mention some traits that successful people maintain which contributed to their success. Before starting with the video, we would ask you to subscribe to our channel if you want such inspiring and valuable content. We hope that this video will keep you hooked until the very end. Therefore, without any further delay, let's begin. It might sound very stereotypical, but waking up early is one of the most common habits that rich and successful people have in common with each other. According to author Thomas Corley, after spending five years studying the lives and habits of rich and poor people alike, it was found that about 44% of wealthy people wake up three hours before work starts, compared to just 3% of poor people. Do you know what the former President Barack Obama, Richard Branson, and Tim Cook all have in common? They are all early risers. We have often heard of the phrase, early to bed and early to rise makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. If we try and pay heed to this very advice that has been handed over to us for generations, nothing might be able to stop us from being successful. Do you get reminded of the times when you were grounded for watching too many television programs? Well, you could have listened to the advisors. The television was correctly named as the idiot box for all that you get from television. You can get through reading as well without getting addicted to unnecessary jargon. According to the author of Rich Habits, the daily success habits of individuals, 67% of rich people only watch TV for an hour or less. Reality shows are watched by 78% of the poor people, while only 6% of the wealthy watch them. In addition to it, 86% of the wealthy love to read, and most of them read for about 30 minutes daily. This world has produced enough literature catering to each and every one of us. If you start reading them, you would hold insights that your peers wouldn't. If the thought of having a greater amount of knowledge does not give you leverage, we don't know what will. With all the various options of chains of restaurants, one might easily get tempted to try out fast food items that will cause more harm than good. It might be tastier and your taste buds will thank you for feeding them with burgers and steak, but the health hazards that come with it might not be good for your pocket. Healthy eating also contributes to a good body that does not malfunction easily. A balanced diet along with exercise will take you places you haven't even thought of. It is worth mentioning that former U.S. President Donald Trump had a very unhealthy eating habit, but doctors eventually had to ask him to change his diet so that he could stay free of health complications. If you do not want these complications to hamper your progress in life, eating healthy is a must. Warren Buffett once said, if you buy things you don't need, you will soon sell things you need. By this statement, one does not mean that wealthy people live in a tiny house, but it surely means that they do not live in excess. Living a minimal life will help you build a habit of identifying what is a luxury and what isn't. This have shall stick to you till the very end and you would be having just enough and not more. When you will be building your wealth and not indulging in luxurious and unnecessary living, you would be able to save a lot more than you would have thought, which in turn will help you save a greater amount for the future. It has been found that wealthy people surround themselves with those who can challenge and question them. We need to learn to critically analyze situations. Gathering wealth is about thinking critically and knowing when to take what step. If you're surrounded by people that confirm your perceptions and hold them true, you won't be challenged and your life would be taken over by monotony. It is easier said than done because we would like others to validate what we think until and unless we are able to take the criticism that is being offered to us, we might never be able to find our inspiration that will propel us forward. Therefore, a friend who is a good critic is far better is far better than a friend who uses sugar-coated words to stay on your good side. 
The one who criticizes wants the best for you, while the one who doesn't couldn't care less about you. Kanye West was once quoted saying, I am living the future, so the present is my past. People who amassed a lot of wealth were not fortune tellers or practiced witchcraft. They tried to foretell the future and what might be. Steve Jobs did exactly this, and he brought us to the revolutionary Apple products. He brought to us Apple that we did not know we needed. Even though the newer products do not quite impress the new generation, it is still in demand because of the precedent that had been set in the initial days of the launch of the company. Building a daily habit of forecasting one's challenges should be once a primary goal. Once we are aware of the challenges, we can set a plan to overcome them. We have all tried creating a to-do list but failed miserably. According to an article in Business Insider, about 80% of the wealthy people maintain a to-do list. They schedule their tasks and work according to the given schedule. Keeping a track of one's time is quite important for it helps us get our priorities straight. If we want to get wealthy and successful, we need to prioritize one over the other and this can only be achieved by maintaining a to-do list. If you're watching this video, you still have time and you still have it in you to be successful. Start with a to-do list and try to maintain it every single day. Now that we have come to the end of the video, we could say that these character traits have been taught to us since we were young. Giving in to temptations, we rejected the idea of following these and surrendered ourselves to our desires. We shouldn't have done that. These traits aren't too difficult to maintain. It requires persistence and the presence of mind. If one is dedicated enough to become wealthy and successful, one can never be stopped and becoming successful would seem like a dream come true. If you like this video, do not forget to subscribe to our channel. If you have any of these traits, mention them in the comments below and check out what others have in common with you.